up, Angolicians? This is Jim Marcalong from Grade 11, St. Bernadette. For this video, we're going to talk about literary work from Africa. So without further ado, let's get started. The title of the book is Mind Boy. Mind Boy is a 1946 novel by South African novelist Peter Ibrahams, set in South Africa. The novel explores the stereotypes and institutions that discriminates against working class black Africans. Mind Boy becomes the first African novel written in English to attract international attention. The author is Peter Henry Abrahams Deres, commonly known as a Peter Abrahams, was a South African-born novelist, journalist, and political commentator, who in 1956 settled in Jamaica, where he lived for the rest of his life. His death at the age of 97 is considered to have been murder. The Plot of Mind Boy a black man Zuma as he goes through the number of struggles, including introduced disease from European as well as political and social trauma. Zuma moves from his town to Malay Camp, a black area of Johannesburg, in a search of work at gold mines. Leia, an illegal beer brewer, gives him a place to live. Zuma is against the racist treatment of black Africans and flights in Zuma falls in love with Leia Mies. Eliza was assimilationist and then with Macy Zuma becomes a successful miner working for the supervisor Paddy. One of Leia tenants, Johans and others die in a mine of accident and Zuma and Paddy lead a strike. The characters of Mind Boy Zuma, Daddy, O'Shea, Johans, Eliza, Leia, Macy. The setting of the story is Molly Camp, a black area in Johan Bridge. Point of view of Mind Boy. The novel is narrated from a third person while the point of view stay with the protagonist Zuma is switches to the secondary character. And the major conflict is Zuma is struggling to find love to find love and safety and prosperity in in his in his society where Rasim restricts his ability to achieve his goals. Context of Mind Boy South African capitalist system deprived the rural population of their lands. This deprivation of their cultivating lands engendered the displacement of the proletariat class to the city to find a better life in 1946. Peter Abrahams released Mind Boy to denounce the exploitation and operation of the blacks by the white people. In a human treatment reserved Zumas in a village rural in Goss and Johan Bush to improve his economic situation in mind. Zumas and predicaments and Johan and Chris deaths in minds illustrate the brutal attitude of their boss, white bosses towards the mine workers. The rising consciousness of the mine workers leads them to a perpetual liberation struggle that finally ends in their historical freedom. He fights for their rights and he finds a job, Zuma's 
mighty job. Then, the findings of hope to reveal the fact that the words given to the characters reveal a lot of their who they are.